Mika! Amazing news! The Big Apple City Museum of Natural History is hosting a seminar tonight on the various strands of rock candy native to the Stone Fruit Mountains. A seminar on rocks? That sounds... Fascinating! I was hoping I could spend an evening of educational rocking and rolling with my little limestone. That would magma day. <laughs> <laughs> See you tonight! Papa. It's pretty adorable how much you and your papa have in common. Hello, my dearest daughter. I have the most stupendous news. Coco Lachelle is showing her new fashion collection tonight, and I have two tickets. As I'm quite chiffoned of you, I was hoping we could attend together. Uh-huh. See you tonight. Mine? How can you go to the rock seminar and the fashion show? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Papa taught me to love learning, but Dad taught me to love fashion. I love both. No matter what I do, I'm letting one of them down. I can't make a decision. I'm really so confused. I don't like these options. Each choice means that I still lose. This or that, or those or these. Oh, I don't really know. I'm split right down the middle. Which way should I go? Any way you slice it, I miss I out on miss something, out fun. On something fun. Everything is ruined even before it's begun. Any way you slice it, the answer I can't see. I'm pulled in both directions, but both directions are me. I think I might go this way. No, wait, I think that's wrong. Go back and turn around now. I still can't find where I belong. Right or left, left or right or up or down. Each way is not quite right. I'm split right down the middle while both sides fight. Any way you slice it, I miss out on something fun. Everything is ruined even before it's begun. But both directions are me. There's a lot of slices when you bake a cake. Delicious choices, which one to take? Oh, it doesn't matter when each one is great. So whatever it is you do. We all love each part of you. What are you doing here? I have a date with our daughter. What are you doing here? Actually, there's an exhibit at the Cumin Time Museum about the history of Big Apple City fashion. I was thinking maybe we could all go together. We can both spend the evening doing something we love. Exactly. History for you and fashion for you. No, Mika. <laughs> what we both love most is spending time as a family, both of us together with you. Slice it? That is one adorable family. <sighs> it is so nice to be able to bake in peace without having to worry about the peculiar purple. Hey there, Snortflake. Huh? Hello, fellow young people. Have you checked out that totally radical new spot across the street? The Peculiar Purple Pie Works. It's like totally trending. Why hang with old school bakers when you can buy from trend makers? Check this upside down muffin. It's hashtag fire emoji. Yeah, so oh, that trendy. youth seems to know what's cool. Why is every berry leaving the berry works? <laughs> Every berry in my office, emergency meeting! On second thought, back to the courtyard. 
Our customers left for the Pyworks. And with no customers, Crab Apple Jam will be upset. And if she's upset, she'll fire me. And if she fires me, my mother. <laughs> the Pyworks is popular because it's trendy. So, we have to be trendier. I've studied all the latest trends in market research. If we follow them, we can't fail. Ah! Are you sure? I've always just followed my gut, not trends. <laughs> and things have worked out pretty well for me in the past. The past isn't trending. The now is trending. <laughs> Scratch that. The future is trending. Okay, Truth Fairy, I don't think this is gonna work. But Fred is our friend. And Strawberries aren't trending. Smoothies are so last week. What people want now are peanut butter sculptures of celebrities with salted caramel sauce. I'm sorry, what? Pet parades are huge on TikTok. March! The data shows attention spans are getting shorter by the second! Everybody needs to work triple. No, quadruple speed! We're not hitting the nostalgia trend yet. Strawberry! Wear this. Are you sure? I just think we should focus on something similar. We've got to go quintuple speed now! Cuter pet parade. Add mayonnaise to the sculpture! I'm sorry, what? Faster! Cuter! Where's the nostalgia? Hey, I know you're trying really, really hard, but I think it's time you listen to your gut. Classic looks are out. Robots are in. Bring me the cake eater. A robot? Really? Ah! 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 Oh, how could the data be wrong? What's that? That is my very, very oven. Earlier, I asked my gut what today needed. And the answer? Sugar cookie twists. Sugar cookies aren't trending. Sugar cookies never trend. Are those sugar cookies? Mm. Mm. Sometimes to find the best treat for your gut, you've got to trust your gut. Come on back! I, I wrote a rap about how awesome the pie works is. I'm Peculiar P, and I'm here to say, eating purple treats is the coolest way to be cool. Um, uh, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> you know, some berries are just too focused on trends. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no! Did Barbacoa Bonanza is a dance, dance, jump, jump, cheers, twist, bye? Come on! It's the hottest trend on TikTok. What are those two doing? They've been working on their TikTok dance all day. Social media is pretty specific, huh? Ooh, really messy. <gasps> oh, where in the ding dong Danish did this mess come from? It's it was them. them. <laughs> Get these critters out of here. The Berry Works isn't a petting zoo. Hold the scone. The pets didn't make that mess. It was sweet tea. They're covered in evidence. <laughs> That's just because I only want to see critters on cute viral internet videos or stuffed and mounted on my wall, not at the Berry Works. Lock them up until you can take them home. Starting tomorrow. They're banned! Banned? <laughs> I'm sorry, Custard. I wish we could figure out what to do. The pets weren't even the ones doing the trendy dance. I know, and imagine cute pets doing a tic taco trend. It would have been so cute, Crabapple would have had to let them stay. Nah, that's too crazy. We'll think of something, I promise.
these pets be any cuter? Aww. That's the barbacoa bonanza. Too bad they don't have tacos. That would really be something. <laughs> Be on the internet. Okay, we have a plan. We just need 300 donuts, a motorcycle, a fishing rod, and whoa. Hmm. What in the banana cream pie is all this commotion? Yay! <laughs> huh, I guess the pets do add value. You can't have them here if they're gonna keep making a mess. Come on, cheating! Those pets are blasting us! I'm doing my best job! They charge five bucks an autograph and I keep 60% of the total earnings. Forty. Fifty. Deal. Hmm. <laughs> wow, look at the mess those pets made. Ow, 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 ow. I think what Custard is trying to say is, pets make everything better. Okay, Strawberry Shortcake, it's time to bake Strawberry Shortcake. Does it stress you out because it's your name and it has to be perfect? <laughs> yes. But you can do this. After you give the Extraordinary Berry a good clean. So, do you think she's actually gonna make it this time? I'm sure she'll... Oh. Uh, how's the shortcaking coming along, shortcakes? Great! Great, great, great. Just need to clean the truck, reorganize the pantry, binge the new season of my favorite cartoon on my favorite streaming service, and then... Ah! <laughs> oh. What you need is to stop procrastinating. Hmm. <laughs> time to go back to the swirly verse. The what? Oh, it's this place in my mind that Blueberry showed me. Pink sky, mountains shaped like ovens, herds of tiny food trucks. <laughs> it's where my lucky spoon talks to me. You think you get used to all the weird eventually. You don't. This helps how exactly? Last time my spoon told me that sometimes baking takes as long as it takes and patience is important. So maybe I wait and try strawberry shortcake another day and ooh. It never hurts to try. Gaze into the boundless sky. Countless strawberries frolic like twinkling stars. You're just one ingredient in this scrumptious universe. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. I remember this. Wait, what's happening? <laughs> ah! Strawberry. <laughs> nice to see you again. <laughs> Why is all this mold everywhere, Spoon? It's easy for things to get moldy when you don't even... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Entirely too chatty for a utensil. <laughs> Wait, you're a moldy version of me? So... I guess I need to learn something from you. Clear the clouds and grow That's and... That's not how this is gonna go. Dessert. What did you do to it? Oh, not me. You. You failed. Like you always knew you would. No, I'm a baker. I know how to make things taste... Disgusting and horrible. A failure every time and there's nothing you can do. <laughs> Never hurts to try. It never hurts to try? And what happens when you fail? I try again. And fail again. And again. So why even try? Because doing nothing means I always fail. The only way to succeed is to keep trying again and again, no matter what. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Lucky Spoon! I knew you'd figure it out. You always get there when you keep on trying. Welcome back. Well, baking does take as long as it takes. But I was so scared of failing, I wouldn't even try. And if I never try, I never succeed. It's time to fail! <laughs> So, about my swirly verse? <laughs> <laughs> you sprouts have fun. Orange, listen to your sister. Cherry Crisp is in charge. Bye, Mom! Bye, Dad! Who's ready for the most awesome slumber party ever? I'm Hiya! down! Ooh, what are we gonna do? I don't know, but I'm sure it's gonna be awesome! <laughs> Any ideas? Hmm. I'm gonna watch Baker's Massacre 4. Y'all can watch it with me. Unless you're too scared. Um, or don't, whatever. How scary are the Baker's Massacre movies? <laughs> so scary! Oh, don't worry, Lon. I got you. The air smells spooky tonight. I'm in. Me too. Yes, sir. I'm not scared. Let's do it. No. Wasabi, don't go in the kitchen. Don't! Uh, the Beasley Baker isn't real. I'll be right back. Amateur. Never say I'll be right back. Huh. Now if it was me, I'd... Ah! Never mind. Uh, that sure was fun, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. And nobody is scared, right? Not me. Nah. No. No. Cool. Me either. Okay. Night berries. <laughs> Maybe the movie was a little scary, but I brought my lucky spoon in my backpack. And with my lucky spoon, I'll be safe. Mm. I just need to go get it. You won't take me, BC Baker! Heaven? Are you scared too? Me? Scared? No! Uh, what are you doing? Setting traps. I thought you weren't scared. I'm not now that I've set traps. Do you very think? Invisible. They're not invisible! Where did they go? They were probably taken by the Beastly Baker. Come on, we gotta find them. <gasps> Stay here, I'll be right back. I said it. You can't leave now. We need to stick together. Over here. <sighs> what the? You were the Beastly Baker. We thought you were the Beastly Baker. Oh, look, a cupcake. Don't blueberry it. <laughs> uh, trap. Freaked out by the movie. Once we admitted we were all scared and took down Lemon's traps, it was way less scary and awesome. Oh, now that's adorable. <laughs> well, um, I'm just gonna go get a snack from the kitchen. <laughs> What's going on in here? Oops, forgot that one. Lemon. <laughs> things are nicely she'll understand i don't understand rules are rules oh 
can't have y'all selling the same goodies I do. That would be pretty bad for my business. But I'm not gonna have any problems from a sweet country berry like you, am I? Well, good. Glad we had this chat. <laughs> That muffin is a violation! I'm eating it, not selling it! Hmm. No. That is one weird berry. What's going on? Welcome to the Resistance. Sweet! How can I help? Well, we've got posters and we're planning a march, but I think we need something bigger. Any ideas? If she won't let us sell what we usually do, we need to sell something different. <gasps> I love it, shortcakes! If none of us are allowed to sell our own treats, then all of us are gonna work together and sell something new! When you're lost and fall and stumble, when the souffle's fall and all the cookies crumble, just what we, we have to say. We're gonna shake things up, it's time to save the day. Sweet victory, stand up and fight. fight. Sweet victory, we gotta fight to do what's right. right. Sweet victory, stand up and fight. fight. You know we're sweet, we're strong, we're gonna set things right. right. No stopping us. smoothie, a drink, or an ice cream. It's all of them, so we're respecting your rules. And Barry seemed to love it. Well, isn't that clever of you? And it's so uh, popular. But maybe y'all should go back to selling the things you did before. Great. 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 And big days need big treats. After all, can't watch Bite of the City without a Bite of the City. Get it? Because they look like the city. Why are you so excited? Crab Apple Jam is a guest judge on Bite of the City. A sweet country baker who moved to the city to make all her delicious dreams come true. Sound like any berry you know? Apparently, she's making some big announcement. Kiki, I've done just about everything I dreamed when it comes to bacon. So I said to myself, Crabapple, what's going to be your cherry on top? Well, I'm as pleased as a possum in a petunia patch to announce the new home for my bacon headquarters, the Big Apple Berry Works. Does this mean Crabapple Jam is taking over the Berry Works? I wonder if Bread knows. No! He knows. If I'm not Berry Works assistant manager anymore, if I can't boss berries around, then who am I? 
Why? Yeah, he's broken. What does this mean for the berry works? Are we getting kicked out? Okay. Very calm down. I find that when I breathe deeply and take in the energy around me, I can see things through calmer eyes. Exactly. Yes. Thank you, Blueberry. <sighs> I think we should panic. <laughs> <laughs> Jam is one of the nicest bakers in the city. Like me. She's got that country charm. Like me. We'll talk to each other country baker to country baker. What does talking country baker even mean? Well, now, don't y'all look as depressed as a bunch of dolphins in the desert. What's wrong? Hi, strawberry shortcake. My friends are all as worried as a whale in a wheat field, but I said I knew you'd clear things right up. Oh, that's what it means. Of course y'all are worried after your experience with that rotten purple pie man. This is totally different. Am I running the berry works now? Yes, but I barely want to change a thing. Y'all have nothing to worry about. See? Nothing to worry about. Well, I'm heading up to the greenhouse, my new restaurant headquarters and gift shop. Cheese Strudel and Cherry Streusel will share the new guidelines with you. Who are some <laughs> jam on bread? You take these. You read these. You live these. A few new rules aren't a big... Ah! No berry may sell the following without express permission from Crab Apple Jam. Baked goods? Drinks? Smoothies? Ice cream? That's an incredibly specific list. I see some no no. <laughs> okay, not what we were expecting. But I'm sure it's nothing we can't figure! <laughs> oh, 